you guys, it's Shannon and I'm back with another fix. It's a stitch fix day again. So again, I have some great new spring pieces. I've actually been pretty excited about stitch fix lately. I think they've had some new inventory, which is fun. As you guys know, I'm also a part-time stylist there. And so I'm always kind of paying attention to what's new and I'm always eager to try it on myself. So let's just jump right into this fix. I just got my big work. This is the first item. It's the Letty and Me Pontel sweater for $48. Um, this is new to our inventory. I've never seen this before and I think it's adorable. It's a nice white color with this pretty feminine Pontel detail and then these wavy stripes and fun bright colors for spring. Let me back up. I'll do a quick spin. I did layer cami underneath because it, they're obviously with the Pontel you can kind of see through it a little bit. But I do think this is really pretty for a cooler spring climate like what we have up here in Minnesota. And yeah, I'm kind of tempted to maybe keep this. All right, we'll keep going. Okay, next we have on the Kaylee, it's called the Gandia Short Sleeve Knit Top in Off-White with Black Stripes. This is actually an extra large. This is $38, and this actually is adorable. I just don't think it's a good cut for me, but I think it could look great on a lot of women. It's almost like a little, like I said, a little Pontel knit top. It's got these cute little stripes, kind of a nice, um, pretty neckline. So I did size up into an XL, and I... I think it fits. I don't think it looks great on me, but I think a lot of women would really like this top. It does have a cute little scallop hem. Let me do a quick spin. And for $38, I think it is adorable for spring and summer if you like the fit. Um, again, new to our inventory. It's always fun to see some new pieces in the mix. All right, guys. So next item is the Nine Britain Fran Flutter Sleeve Blouse in purple. It's actually a purple floral. I actually sized up in an XL on this. It's $44. So I'm actually glad I sized up. The large probably would have been fine, but I like just a little more blousiness at the waist. So um, I am a sucker for flutter sleeves and floral. And then it does have this really cute little keyhole detail, which actually I noticed is a button. So let me see if I can undo it. So if you want to wear it more as a split neck, you could. I actually think it's cuter buttoned. And again, under $50, that makes me happy. Let me do a quick spin. So this could be a keeper just because I think it's cute and definitely cute for the office. Um, and the other colors in it are sort of like a soft pink, kind of almost a creamy yellow, and then that purple. So lots of things you could pair this with. All right, we'll keep going. All right, next up we have a really cute little casual knit top. This is, I believe, The Fortune and Ivy, sorry, Tarn Cutout Detail Knit Top in Light Pink, size large, $38. And okay, so this feels really soft and comfortable. I just love it when it feels like a tee, but with some cute details. So the cutout is right here and here, just a nice round neck. And then it does have a little banded bottom. Um, I do think this is cute. I think it's a good price. I feel like I get a lot of requests as a stylist for cute, comfortable knit tops, and this definitely fits that. Bill, you could definitely wear this with trousers for work, or you could wear it with jeans or shorts. The only thing I don't love is I don't like this really dusty, neutral pink color. I like something a little more bright or vibrant, but I know a lot of people do like the neutrals. Let me do a quick spin. So again, I think this is good. And also, I feel like this is newer too. I think this is something from the spring. So again, another, another new style. Maybe they'll offer it in some other colors and I might grab it. All right, one more piece, you guys. All right, guys, last piece is a navy and pink floral maxi dress. This is by the brand, The General Good. It's called the Michelle Maxi Dress in navies. I actually did get an extra large on this because sometimes I just like a little more room in the torso. And this is $58. And I actually think this is surprisingly cute and surprisingly tempting. <laughs> so we'll talk a little bit about it. It has... Um, these adjustable straps, but this side has sort of the little ruffle and this side's this so little asymmetry going on. There's a little ruffle here. It is surplus, but there is a, it's actually sewn. So you don't have to worry about that coming open. Again, it's got like ruffles down the front and ruffles along the hem, which I just love. I think the colors are pretty. And then the navy actually has sort of a texture, like a floral texture um, on it. So that adds a little depth to it. And of course the, like I said, it just feels kind of very pretty and ethereal and just really fun for a date night. Let me do a spin so you can see the back. 
Um, I do think this dress is strapless bra worthy. <laughs> I'm willing to, I did pull out the strapless bra for this. Um, and for 58 bucks, I feel like that is a pretty good price, even though I really don't need more dresses. Um, so that was the full fix, you guys. And I do feel like we got some good pieces at good prices. Everything was below $60. So where's that one top for 38? There was no two for $38. And there was one for 44, one for 48. And then this dress is 58. So the total on this tick, uh, fix is $226. So you'd probably save about 60 bucks. Um, if you got the buy five discount, as you guys know, I get a little bit more than that. Um, but yeah, this was really fun. I'm, I'm so happy to see new pieces in our inventory, especially at these more affordable price points. Cause this is kind of the price points that I like to shop at. And I feel like a lot of my clients like this price point too. Um, also, by the way, I'd never tried this general good brand before. I feel like it, I don't know if it's new, but in the, I haven't seen it in the last three years and it's surprisingly good. I was afraid it might be a little too fitted or a little more juniors, but it's not. So definitely don't, uh, don't be afraid to try it as well. All right, guys, what did you think? What pieces should I be keeping? What pieces should I be sending back? Um, anyway, if you like this kind of content, please give me a thumbs up and consider subscribing. Also, definitely let me know if you have a channel and what you are getting in your fixes these days and if you feel like you're seeing an improvement. Anyway, thanks. Bye.